Mr. Johnson, do you have any acknowledgement of a debt for the birthday party? Do I have any acknowledgement of In debt writing, for... either by text or email? Yes. May I see it? This is a text showing apology for messing up my finances. This is her tax estimate, which is more than $2,000. Okay, can I see the text? Please? I also have a text here that says that the only thing I've ever done for her was loan her money, and I have a check with a balance acknowledging just how much the loan was. Just a second. What is the next thing that you have? I have another text that says the only thing I've ever done for her was loan her money. Yeah, I and see then it. I have the initial check that was written to my mom in agreement to repay the loan, oh, just showing a, a $4,700 with a $4,200 uh, balance in her writing. This is unimportant to me, this check. Would you look at the last thing that you wrote to him? I agree with that. Yeah. I agree with I know. The loans that I've made, I paid him back when they were loans. Well, there were only one loan that I know about. What other loan is there? He's loaned me money to take care of cell phones. He's loaned me money to buy shoes. Anytime we discuss a loan, I paid him back. Well, you He's, didn't pay him back for the car. That's what he asked me to do. He said, no, take he that and put it on. This is the agreement that we made sitting in his office. He said, tell you what, just put this on the cons bill. So that's what I did. He didn't say anything much, else about the balance. Mr. Johnson, how much did you have to pay the venue the day that you arrived and you found out that the vendors hadn't been paid? The venue had to be paid um, $1,000. $2,400 along with her son that paid a portion of that balance as well. So the venue hadn't been paid, the uh, entertainer, the DJ, nor the caterer. How much in total did you $2, pay? 2700 That's what I thought. You have a son? Yes, ma'am. Stand up, please. Tell me your first name. Jamarcus. Would you tell me how much you paid towards your mother's birthday party? I think it was like three seventy-five. Close to 400 bucks. What did you pay the $400 for? Uh, simply because whenever... Uh, no, I... what did you pay it for? Did you just pay it, or did you pay it for music? Did you pay it for flowers, or just hand $400 to somebody? When I arrived at the venue, it was late after I got off work, and then the lady who owns the venue, she was saying that it was a remaining balance, and I, with this being my mom, I was like, okay, what, I, I'll pay it. I don't even know what it was for. And the lady was just well, like... were you with together business. with the plaintiff? I was. We were together. When you went into the venue? Correct. And so you were surprised that there was a balance? Correct. And what about Mr. Jackson? Was he surprised that there was a balance, too? Did he appear to be surprised? I think he was. Yeah, I think I'm so, too. I'm not sure. I think so, too. Judging for the plaintiff for the amount of $3,387. We're finished. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Bodies are excused. You may step out. It was not personal, just business. Bitter. Mr. Jackson, I believe. It was a total loan. The, the monies were separate. He's very disappointed about our breakup. I just decided that I did not want to be around anybody that was... I've always reached out to try to be his friend.